Hello everyone, uh, Snipe Trading here. Today is Wednesday, June 26th. I'll be going on my recap for today. Um, so I just traded a few stocks today. Um, most of my win was uh, from the Starbucks uh, overnight short from yesterday. Um, so I had a short at um, pretty much near the close here, around 84.16, uh, around here. I uh, had a week open, uh, bounce, uh, had a little bounce, so I just kind of took it off to re evaluate the trade. I uh, went ahead to retest the uh, green to red there um, and fell. So I went ahead and started short here, um, and then when it fell to hold um, this um, here, had a descending triangle, it broke. Went ahead and short that cover a few here and here and here um, my final target was 8350s so I hit the final target there uh, which I just covered the rest there um, so 8450 if you look at the daily here so this is where 8350 was um, the 90 MA um, so that's why I covered it there and it had a little bounce uh, eventually it came back down but it had a bounce here so it's consolidating around this uh, 90 MA area uh, so that was a hundred and seventy four dollar winner from that short on Starbucks. I Also tried Nvidia. So Nvidia here had a nice breakout here on this uh, cup and handle uh, I went ahead and started short a little early here um, I was waiting hoping for a 9 EMA retest uh, cup and handle break here Went ahead and short it was like by a penny. So it was like 36 to 234 it broke this low by yeah, just a few pennies and kind of bounced back. I uh, didn't like the move, so I stopped out. Uh, that was a $18 loss. Uh, NVIDIA. OSTK. So OSTK had a... I tried this a couple times, so I think I took like a $20 loss here. Um, shorting for this 90 MA break. Uh, and it was trending this 5 minute pretty well. But... I started short, covered a few, and then it stopped out. Um, and then here I short again for this break. Uh, kind of see this cup and handle for me. And I think it was on the five minute EMA. Uh, yeah, so it was on the five minute here. So you can see it broke below. Went ahead and uh, short and then cover. Uh, and then it had another, uh, there was like a trend line break here. So you draw a trend line here. Uh, I really fought this here. I think I took a $50 loss here. Uh, and then I eventually gained it all back from this. Uh, actually, cause, because of this trend line break, I started short, um, then covered most of my shares there and took a small uh, reshort there. Um, and then end up covering when it broke above the highs of here. So I ended up taking a little small loss there, um, but it was a $25 um, loss overall on OSTK. Um, so overall, I still need to be more patient, uh, make sure all the time frames are aligned and taking the short when it's ready and not to go in early. Um, but uh, yeah, that's all I have for today. Um, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. If you haven't done so, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like, and comment. Thank you. Bye-bye.